morning, Ithaca High School, and welcome to Lake Street News. I'm Adam Andreas Danger Thompson. And I'm Jeremy Coyle. Let's get right to the news. On April 29th, the IHS Green Team has given students the chance to take a free early morning bus ride to attend the Climate March on Washington. At the march, protests will be standing up for stopping climate change, along with fighting for equality and public safety everywhere. Thousands of men and women will, stand, uh, to, will attend to stand up for what they know to be right. In response to the Trump administration's latest executive order that begins to repeal the Clean Power Plan and environmental protections, the People's Climate Movement is demonstrating itself as a massive and wide-reaching movement in opposition to this dangerous step that puts people and the planet in grave danger. That's right, Adam. Are you confused about the college admissions process? The Student Services Department is hosting a Getting Into College Night where admissions officials from Cornell, IC, and SUNY Binghamton will talk about the admissions process and what they look for in applica applications. Excuse me. This event will be held on April 24th at 6 p.m. in Culp Auditorium. The event is for 11th graders, but 9th and 10th graders are welcome as well. An official bill has been passed making the state schools in New York free of tuition as an added step to include students in need of financial aid. The state school includes SUNY and CUNY schools across New York. Governor Andrew Cuomo announced this decision last Saturday on the 8th of April. One of the restrictions of this plan is that in order for a student to receive it, they must stay in New York State after graduation. This bill is heavily based on the campaigns of Hillary Clinton and Bernie Sanders with their mentions of the revival of free tuition colleges. Cuomo had to fight against private schools throughout New York to pass this bill. Private colleges worried they would, be, they would lose students to SUNY schools due to the free tuition. There's a lot of controversy, even now, about whether colleges need tuition. The chancellor of SUNY, Nancy Zimfer, has said that she thinks the bill has put them on the precipice of a new era in which a four-year education after high school is seen as essential. She also says taking tuition off the table is going to, quote, change the college-going culture. Ithaca native indie American rock group X Ambassadors will return home to host the Cayuga Sound Festival. The band announced this inaugural festival on Instagram, saying, quote, We're bringing that noise back to where it all started. Cayuga Sound is the music festival we dreamed of as kids in Ithaca. Eclectic, cutting edge, and daring musicians from all over the world, all sharing the same stage together. Unquote. The band hopes to bring recognition to the Ithaca area and help boost the music scene in the town. The Roots, Jukebox the Ghost, Tai Chi, The Knox, and a number of other local artists will be performing at the festival. The event is set to take place in Stewart Park, where two stages will be set up to accommodate a variety of genres. The festival will be held on September 22nd to 23rd. Tickets have been on sale since March, since March 31st and are currently running at 59.50 on CayugaSoundFestival.com. VIP tickets are also available. Unfortunately, we will be in hiatus for this next week for spring break. So our next show will be on Friday, May 5th. Sorry about that. It's okay. I think they understand. You better understand. Have a lovely break. Are we keeping that take? I thought it was pretty good. Uh, what's, what is... What does executive mean? Like and who's natal? Oh, that's a little unfortunate. And the anchors are going to be blessed. Who did the least word here? Huh? Oh. You know what they say? Acting is the lowest talent in the industry. It is. Is that a rap? If children can do it, it is. Is that a rap? Boy. What? That was